In this video, I'm going to show you how you can link your Google Calendar with a Go High Level Calendar. Now, why this is important? Well, Google Calendar is still one of the most widely used calendar in the world. And if you have something on in your Google Calendar, you want it to be reflected in your Go High Level account. Same thing as Go High Level account. When you have an appointment coming in, in Go High Level account, you want it to show up in your Google Calendar because it's easier for you to check, right? Like for me, myself, I have my Google Calendar on most of the time. With this integration, at least when there is a new appointment coming in through Go High Level, you can see it inside our Google Calendar. Now, before I continue, I do have a video on Go High Level Calendar. Do watch it so that you can have more understanding on how to use a Go High Level Calendar. Now, why this is important? It is important because when you create a Go High Level Calendar, you'll notice one thing where you need to create users. And in the previous video, I've already shown you step by step where you can link between a user and also a calendar. Now, before I proceed to show you how you can link the Google Calendar with your Go High Level Calendar, if you're new to this channel, do subscribe to this channel and give me a thumbs up. It will really help this channel out. Okay, so now let's log into your Go High Level account. So this is the agency, the Fine X Digital. All you have to do is go to Settings, Integration, and Sign in with Google. One thing to really take note is that when you look at top right, you can see there's a few different accounts, right? Different users. There's a few different users. I'm using the main user right now, all right? But if you have individual team members, individual users, just make sure they are logged in into the right user and add in the right Google account, okay? So now let's go to sign in with Google. So I sign in with my personal account so that I want to link my personal calendar to the Go High Level calendar. Okay, allow. Close. And then you can see this link here to unlink. Just click on the connector button and it will, you know, disconnect. It will delete the Google connection. Now you can go to my profile and you can see down here, there's a two different way you can add in the calendar. There's a primary calendar here and check for conflict. You can see that it's yellow, so it's not sync. Just click on edit. And then I can pick this calendar, all right? Select primary calendar. And then you can select default calendar because there, there are a few calendars that you can use it. All right. For example, if your own Google account got a few calendars, so that's so you can choose it. But without anything, I just choose what I have. Okay. And click save. All right. Close. You see, it's connected now. Okay. So you can check for conflict and click here. So you can check these places for conflict. For example, holidays in Malaysia. If I have holiday, then I do not want any appointment to come in. For example, so you just can click everything here. All right. And just click save. So that when there's any appointment at time, we will block that time as well. Just click close. All right, this is how you can link. Okay, another place you can add your calendar up, apart from my profile is you go to my staff. Uh, you can see there's two different team members. So for this, I cannot edit. Uh, if you see, I edit here. I, I can't change the Google Calendar configuration. Only this member can. So you need to log in to that account as I mentioned just now. So you can see there's a login as because I'm an admin so I can see. But if I'm not an admin, I don't see it. So this is actually another account. Like for example, another team member account. And, that's, and they have to log in personally to add in the Google Calendar. So for now, this is my account that I'm using. So you just have to click edit. Then you can see the Google Calendar configuration is still here. Both of them are here. All right, so it's the same place. So this is the two places where you can add a Google Calendar. Okay, so yeah, that's how it's Easily you can link the Google Calendar with Go High Level Calendar. Alright, subscribe to this channel if you haven't done so and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.